I mean, uh, I must admit, one of the first, I think, probably one of the things that got me interested in psychiatry was um, as a medical student <coughs> um, being asked to see someone who thought they had been taken over by, I think it was Sid Vicious. Now, does anybody know who Sid Vicious is? He was <laughs> right. in the Sex Pistols. Yeah, okay. So someone thought they'd been taken over by Sid Vicious, and there's a Catholic girl, and she thought she'd been taken over by Sid Vicious. And she said, well, what I really want is an exorcism. Now, what people don't realise is in every parish, every Church of England parish in the UK, there is a regional exorcist. Every parish in the UK has its own exorcist. And they will come along free of charge and do an exorcism. And so well, we rang up the regional exorcist um, and the regional exorcist came along, did an exorcism, ex exorcism and she got better. And when I, by the time I'd left medical school, she was still better. And a few years later, she was still better. Uh, and it seemed to work for her. Um, I think three or four times now in the UK, subsequent to that, people had asked for exorcisms and we organised somebody to come and do the exorcism. And, it's, and it hasn't worked. Yeah. But they wanted it. And so we, uh, we said, well, no scientific evidence, not sure what will happen. Our position is that we will work with you to find someone who's at least competent. You go and do it. You stick with us. If it works, it works. If it doesn't work, we try something else.